Well, we know it's a hot mag, and we know that it's a fart. So I guess I should have checked the check ball on this, because it's probably dry and probably stuck. What we have here is a failure to communicate. Because it doesn't want to communicate with me. Alright, so what we have here today is my new-to-me, still-in-the-family sandwich cub. So I have multiple different size sandwich engines. And this is out of my dad's collection. I was going to also try and get his other sandwich engine. I think it was a four horse. But I'd rather have had the Cub over that one. So I went through and made sure everything was good to go on it. Oiled everything down. The only thing I did not do is check the check ball in the gas tank, which I put gas in it starts off starter fluid just can't keep it running because of course it's not sucking gas so I need to take the gas tank off probably and um, check to see if the check ball is stuck in it if the check ball is stuck get it unstuck and then put it back together and uh, run it because it fires up quite nicely and that so just to get it where it's going in the appropriate direction and get it to where it runs consistent. So, um, yeah, I'll take this tank off and see what I can see here. Um, looks like some of the, my dad's work since it's a square bit that's holding it on there. And I should have some smaller square bits. I'm not for sure what size square bit that is. I may not have that size if it's something smaller than this. It's smaller than that one. I don't know if I have anything smaller than this. I don't even know if I have any other size square bits. Um, so I guess I gotta track down one of those. Those look to be the same size. Those are larger. Hmm. I don't know if I have a small enough square bit. So this is what I spend half my time doing, is trying to locate things I need to be able to do the things I want to do. Uh, somewhere there is a bit set. I may have one. So I need this. Alright. Throw this over here. Come with me. Little gas tank. I need to undo this hose completely. I have it out. I'm gonna clean that up a little bit. Should paint the bottom of the tank. It's all gross. Nasty. It would have been nice if the check ball was in this section of the line. Then it has one. Huh. Interesting. Just need to find a pick. 
not sure how this is kind of put together. You know, this would have been a great thing to do when the tank was completely empty and dry, but I could have flipped it upside down and... Try a screen on the bottom, freaking jabbing on us. The funny thing is, there's fuel in there. It is not. Coming out the breather hole. Well, this is absolutely bone dry. What I can do is put a little bit of air probably down the fill tube. See whether I put my finger over the breather hole. And see if I can get gas to squirt out the top of this thing. I'm sure this is going to go really well. Alright. Let's give her some pressure. Hmm. This is why I like pipe joint compound. It works so much better. Well, let's try it with. Hmm. Mm. Yeah, that just blows right back. Oh, uh, I see what I did. Ha! Huh, I cracked my the housing on my freaking. On my air thing. That's great. Um, so I've managed to crack my air wand. I'm trying to screw this up next. Because I blew down into it. Well, maybe we'll in a second. Well, let's try the stupid air truck that I broke. Let's see whether we can get. Some air coming up through it. You know, we tighten it with a freaking. Well, I guess it doesn't matter. It needs to be popped off anyway. Duh. No? Yep. Need it off. What the heck, yo? There we go. All right. All right, we got the check ball unstuck. -ed. Ooh. 
Oh, it's really 